Hello, everyone. Welcome to Light Language Messenger. And for those of you watching on the Great Awakening Generator, you are very, very welcome here. <laughs> it's good to be talking with you again. And thank you so much for watching and for liking all the videos that are coming out. Um, and as you know, on Monday or yesterday, we um, put up the tapping techniques by um, Barbara Stark. She has returned after the Mercury retrograde recess. <laughs> and um, we will be doing that. There's another one coming out Monday next week. And uh, we'll see how we go, if there will be more of the tapping techniques. And hey, if you are getting benefit from the tapping techniques, please share that information with us and request for more. Give us some ideas of what you'd like to have tapping on. Topics, things that you're going through in your life and you don't know how to navigate them. And we will be talking about them. And of course, as usual, I'll be the crash test dummy. <laughs> okay, right. So I kind of took yesterday off <clears throat> uh, from the light language messages. I, I usually take the weekends off. And um, yesterday I, I decided I would, um, I was just not up for it, to be honest. I didn't have the energy for it. I want to say, Part of that was feeling a little bit disappointed because one of the posts that we did of the light language uh, that was activating the 12 strands of DNA, we uh, we hit like 450 views on that. And I noticed this on Thursday last week. And then I noticed that the numbers number of views were steadily declining. And then they were increasing and then they were declining and then they were increasing. And this happened all weekend long. And I thought, I wonder what's happening with that because was the 454 that I saw, was it legitimate? Um, was there a glitch in the system? Was there a mistake? I didn't know. And I felt rather discouraged because I started to think all sorts of things as you do, right? Uh, you know, what's happening? Because, you know, you can have subscribers unsubscribe, but... I didn't know that you could have viewers unview something, right? And I don't even know if there's a view, a word called unview, but there you go. That's what happened. And now the number sits at 290. Now, I am not making any assumptions about it because I believe that there must be a logical explanation. Um, but I've got to say that it definitely made me stop and think about what I want to do on the channels, on Light Language Messenger and on the Great Awakening Generator because I really want to work with people who have integrity. That's what I need to say. And if I, if there's, it's not a logical, if there's no logical explanation to why we have people unviewing the videos, then I don't know. I don't know what that's all about. I have written to YouTube and asked them if they will explain it. I'm waiting to hear back, but I just needed to come on and say that because I'm sure that some of you watching the channel would have, recognize that there was something odd going on with that number. Okay. And for that in particular, anyway, so let's talk about today. I just wanted to clarify that or say something about it because I feel that it was necessary to, to talk about that because if I noticed it, I watched the channel a lot, obviously, because I'm checking the statistics on it and I'm really keen to know that the work I'm doing is actually meaning something to somebody. Um, so I thought I'd explain that to you. Now, today's light language message. <clears throat> on Sunday, when we were doing the Words of the Light series on the Great Awakening Generator, we do that on Sundays with Claudia Titchens. The messages I got came from I, I, my part in the Words of the Light series. I, I checked in with my guides about what uh, I was to talk about. And the message really that I got was to give encouragement that everything was going to turn out all right, that any project you're working on, anything that you are looking forward to, to embark on something new, that it was going to work out. And so what actually snuck into this was the rainbow dragon that is there in the Beyond Lemuria deck. And um, I've got to say that this dragon is something else. It's awesome. It's beautiful. And if you see it, you'll know what I'm talking about. However, we have been working with the dragons from um, the book by Diana Cooper called Dragons, Your Celestial Guardians. And so I looked in the book and I thought, well, let's see if, about the rainbow dragons here. And of course, 
lo and behold, of course, there's rainbow dragons. There's something about rainbow dragons in there. I feel like today, and I said it on Sunday in the Words of the Light series, uh, live transmission, I feel like the rainbow dragon wants to come forth and give us a message. Now, if you didn't catch that, that's okay, but catch it if you can. Uh, it was on it's on Sunday on the Great Awakening Generator at 9 a.m. I thought it was a very beautiful session we had because some interesting things came out in that. So I did that Rainbow Dragon and I had another card with it as well. And I um, I did the light language for that. And I think I vaguely remember saying, I think this Rainbow Dragon is what we have to focus on in the next light language session. And so I'm bringing in the Rainbow Dragon. So we're going to read about the Rainbow Dragon. I'm going to read Diana Cooper's version of it. But Diana Cooper's version of it is very much like that of the Beyond Lemuria deck. All right. And I am going to put us on musician's mode first. And then I'm going to share the screen. Right. So here we are, friends. I have taken this copy of the card and the picture of the rainbow dragon from these people. This website called whispersonthewing.com. Whispersonthewing.com. So that's not my uh, picture. It's one that whispersonthewing.com used to give a message through. And I couldn't find a good enough picture of the dragon um, uh, in the deck. So I just decided that I would use that picture and I will reference them. And I'm going to reference them anyway. And so if you want to go and and check out um if you want to go and check out what what's actually uh what whispers on the dragon is all about then by all means feel free to do that <sighs> does it say whispers on the dragon oh no i didn't mean that whispers on the wing i beg your pardon <laughs> right i have to say that changing screens and sharing screens can actually become quite distracting but please look at this dragon with me this is the rainbow dragon. According to Diana Cooper, it brings the leap of joy that opens new doors. And it says, have trust, rediscover wisdom, expect miracles and accept opportunities. The Beyond Lemuria deck, it's the number four card in the Beyond Lemuria deck, as you can see. And it's called Radical Expansion. So really, the Rainbow Dragons are connected, aren't they? The one in the Beyond Lemuria deck, as well as the one that Diana Cooper is talking about, because it's talking about expansion. It's talking about new opportunities. It's talking about new doors opening. So today, I just want us to, I must stop saying it like that, because it's, I sound really bossy. Today, I would really like us to appreciate this dragon. And um, just bring the dragon in and appreciate what it stands for, what it means to us, what it's here to do. If you can see this, and I think you can, we are now looking at that. There's another card I've put up here. Because on Sunday, we were talking about grounding. We were talking about the root chakra, clearing the root chakra, balancing the root chakra. And so that is a lot. Our successes, our confidence, our, the seat of um, our expansion here in the third dimension, I think, is that root chakra, right? Pardon the pun, because we sit on the root chakra. That's our seat to function here and to and to move forward with everything we do in our lives. So I want to bring up that. This is awesome that I've figured this out without actually figuring it out. Here is the Beyond Lemuria rainbow dragon. This dragon, if you look at it, it's got beautiful colors. It's got mountains. It's got the, the, sun, the sunset or sunrise. It's, it's kind of a mischievous little thing, isn't it? It's beautiful. It's, <laughs> I love it. You've got the use of the throat chakra 
you've got the pinks of the heart chakra. You've got the green. Yeah, you've got the green there. You've got the solar plexus color, the yellow. A woman stands here. She's standing up with her hands raised to the heavens with all those flowing garments, but her heart chakra is open. Let's bring up the... This is the dragon. It's not a grand picture, I'm afraid. My cards have not arrived yet. My dragon cards have not arrived yet, but they will be very soon. But look at this dragon. It's coming off the rainbow. And all the colors on the rainbow coming through with it. And there we go. There's clouds. But there is also the sun in the background. Right, friends. Right, we want everybody up here. Let's see if we can bring everybody up. Yes, Koro. There we are. Wow. Easy transition. Look at the arrows. <laughs> right. Everybody, let's bring in Archangel Michael and Archangel Metatron first before we go into the language. Archangel Michael, Archangel Metatron, We welcome you in in our space, in our time. We welcome you here. We thank you, Archangel Michael and Archangel Metatron, for the protective cloaks that you provide for us. For me, that is here delivering this message of light through the light language. For those that will watch it now, for those that will watch it in the future, we ask for the protection of the legions of angels that work with the archangels, as we have mentioned them. Every message, every action that we take on both light language messenger and the great awakening generator is going to reach those that need it. Everything that comes, everything that comes to, to bring this to naught is actually not going to succeed. It's going to be totally unsuccessful. All those things that are sent to make this unsuccessful is going to be totally destroyed in terms of it will never rise up and it will never win. So friends, as we do this, look at our dragons. These dragons have come to give us the protection. They have come to create and line us to new opportunities in our lives. Many of us are wondering, where to from here, universe? So, I'm going to read about the rainbow dragon out of the book. And then we are going to go through a process of light language. In which I will read the process out to you. And we will then invoke the promise this visualization is actually to travel with the rainbow dragon and to bring something back to with you from the rainbow. Rainbow dragons. A rainbow is not just a physical response to atmospheric conditions. It is also a cosmic portent bringing a gift from the universe to you. If your heart leaps with joy and wonder when you see a rainbow, you have accepted the gift. On the other hand, if you shrug and think it is simply a rainbow, you have declined the present offered to you. When you respond with delight to the sight of a rainbow, the universe opens new doors for you. It may be a new job or relationship, an unexpected opportunity or an astonishing miracle. The universe works in many mysterious ways and often we do not recognize the cause and effect. Right. Do you agree? Do you agree? I like to show you how to do it. I like to show you how to do it. I like to show you how to do it. 
Next title in this chapter, A Cosmic Gift. Like the rainbow arching through the sky, the beautiful mystical rainbow dragon brings you the gift of a promise. When you acknowledge it, a multicolored magical flame ignites within you as you merge your unique energy with that of the dragon. It magnetically attracts something of special meaning to you from the universe. It may draw something from the universal pool of abundance or it may open doors of opportunity or reignite a beneficial past life link that can be drawn into your life. When you connect with the rainbow dragons, magic is in the air. Look out for the look out for and expect miracles. Trust the universe to have your highest interest at heart. At the same time, the rainbow dragon metaphorically takes you over the rainbow to find the pot of gold that awaits you. This mysterious reward may be the return of some of your own ancient wisdom that has been stored by your soul in a golden orb in the planes of learning, which may have been waiting for many lifetimes to be accessed by you. Or it may be ancestral knowledge or wisdom that was held in the temples of time within the halls of a menti, the learning halls in the inner planes. The halls of Amenti are the learning halls in the inner planes. The rainbow dragons may even bring forward for you spiritual knowing from the vast storehouse of the collect collective consciousness. Do not be surprised if you have sudden insights or flashes of wisdom. Sometimes the rainbow dragons breathe into your crown chakra and open one or more of its petals to access universal knowledge. They nudge you to use the knowledge wisely and for the highest good. They also remind you that when you share universal knowledge, more will be downloaded to you. This keeps the flow going. How do you know a rainbow dragon is with you? How do you know? So, if you cannot see it or sense its presence, how do you know this dragon has come to you? <laughs> How do you know? Come on, we're talking about it right now. That's all you know. That's my thought pattern. Let's see what she says. Of course, you may be presented with a physical rainbow across the sky. You may film a rainbow orb or see a rainbow in a book or, a tel or on television. You may catch a flash of multicolored light refracted from a piece of glass. You may find yourself thinking of a rainbow dragon as it whispers to you of its closeness. These are your hints to expect the unexpected. Look for opportunities now. Trust and you will be rewarded. Oh, friends. <clears throat> we cannot make this up. I just think about how we closed off last week's light language messages. And now we have presented with the rainbow dragon. <laughs> I just want to laugh. I'm excited. Are you excited? It's Karababa here, no Kuraba. Right, friends, there's our rainbow dragon. And there's the one out of the Oracle deck. <clears throat> So please find a place where you can be quiet with and undisturbed. We are now going to visualize traveling with the rainbow dragon. <clears throat> Before you close your eyes, I like Shulola Ashele me ke lo kolo kota la la le koto falai na kolo kala mai to kora mai lo kota hi eje ve je ve le kocho kolo maha koro taka taka ra mai. So we want to put our feet firmly, place our feet firmly on the ground. Oma kara kata koro kata kara kai kutu kai kutu ke te kato kota kata ra kai te kuru to to ra mai ke chale ke chulo lo 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 hai. Hola makito fa hi hu hu. Hello, hello, lo kuto lo maha hello. la ma hi la ma hi lo mo da la le la va do 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 do. Ikala ma hua 
Kasela koto farana haire Friends with your feet firmly planted on the ground. Domorai kitoro. Take a moment. Kulama kitoro kota here. Take a moment to breathe. A very deep breath. As we say, in through the nose, all the way down to the bottom of the belly, scrunching and really, really pushing it down on the pelvic muscles. Oh, karakita kara kaita kara kaita kara kota he ya. Oh, um, delegate. Oh, delegate. Salale gulu lulu di li di da balau lulu chiemale ko. Yes, my friends, kots kats kets karamako to farai olo rujini keda karamako. Now close your eyes, close your eyes, because imagine a rainbow arching across the sky. Ooh, ooh, ila le 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 lulu la le mesa kuto 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 aika aika uka uka ho. See or sense a soft rainbow-colored dragon emerging from it. It's olo maho. Ho, ho. If you're looking at one that looks like this one, it's coming at you, baby. It's coming off the rainbow and just curling, curling, twirling, twirling toward you. If it's like that one, then what is it doing? If it's like this one on the dragon card from the oracle deck look at I miss te watch it glide joyfully towards you it's a zale zale za veko sambe ke tola fe ana ke ro koko te hoa hi hi lo mai now let your heart open like the woman in the picture julu julu ve le jele ke to it's coming through with delight open your heart with delight and anticipation lak to frane do tara ka te kara kara ma ku and as this dragon comes, it's coming in with all that traction and motion. It then stands in front of you. Its huge heart pours love over you. Now reach out and stroke this dragon. Not only has it come with the rainbow, but it's got wind blowing through it. Yeah, yeah, it's a cool dragon. Can you tell? No, no worries there, right? There are a lot of clouds. There should be some air involved in this. Can you feel the movement? Can you feel the wings blowing in the wind? Strands. Strands of this of the feathers, oh, strands of the feathers, strands of the strands of the wings, the feathers on the wings are like a chalama Yes, it must have some strands, it's got scales. Yeah, stroke this dragon, it's so loving, my friends. It's such an amazing dragon. It's got such a down-to-earth energy. This dragon has your highest and your best interests at heart. Now, as it stands in front of you, it's... It, its huge heart pours love over you and you are stroking it, right? Now it's inviting you and saying, Come on, my lovely. Come on, my lovely. Do you want to sit on my back? It wants, it's inviting you to sit on its back. So climb. Climb. 
get on it it's helping you can you see it ila ma kutto faraketa na ma ke ho 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 he lo 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 va he now together the two of you flow happily with the currents oh he kale mete kele ketsaka roho hey my friends i feel this warm energy going through me do you feel it ila lo 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 hu this dragon is so in harmony with us it's so in harmony with you it's a maro no 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 kishele you climbed on it and suddenly you feel like you're part of it it's a koro makefe you don't have to hold on for dear life ila kotoro ho you're flowing you're gliding ele mele melo you're flowing you're gliding lele leke leko hi la katolo kase a he oh you're so happy the two of you and are suddenly as you're flowing and you're gliding with the currents a huge golden gate appears in front of you kelemi 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 nothing you know what you touch it and you push it open and your dragon says no now look for the magic and then the dragon soars with you up the curve of the rainbow over the world and down to the other side iskela makoro koro koro ale la le la vona hey a pot of gold awaits you here this pot of gold is not necessarily filled with gold coins it's filled with that thing that is a promise from the universe to you let me let it go lo 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 la click lo lo is it to remember your light language it is to acquaint is it to acquaint you with knowledge from from past lives that you need for now to to use it to to create your life as you stand right now in this time and space oro koro kora mahilu a pot of gold my friends now pick it up ila kotoro ra kitara ra ra hi kora mai hulo matele na hi pick it up and hold it hold it while the dragon the rainbow dragon takes you back to where you started ulu lu 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 before you get there you're having so much fun yeah you're holding your pot of gold even that is part of this dragon's body ikile ke lo mo you're flowing you're soaring ila la la kushala ma hai you're flowing you're floating lem le click la fly hey la le ke la cla fly la ke la mo ha ke la ke se ke lo fle ke te la hi koro ka se se ke ke lo ka hi karo mai le 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 ho a o a now my friends thank you dragon i le me le le lo lo na ma ke to no ma le ke ta la ka to to fa ina koro ho thank you rainbow dragon Thank you my beautiful rainbow dragon dalike 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 ho hallelujah sol mahi hele kolo mahane la he solo vele kela kolo maka hai he ha u la he na he Ela mahoa zorai Now my friends feel your feet back here planted firmly on the ground Come back to this moment and open your eyes Ela kichulo kurukuta hena karai Take one more look at the dragon on the screen kala me kitukara na katatata This picture it's very alive this picture you can feel the breeze you can feel the you can feel the dragon's mane flowing in the wind you can feel the garments of the lady in the picture just flowing around her and you you can feel the blue peaceful cloud the clouds flowing in the blue sky a lot of peace a lot of orbs a lot of 
Stars, a lekitoro kutala karato torona katatara ketataro kutorona mahai. Orokula kechela lele sai koro mahai. So now I'm going to stop sharing, my friends. Ela kasafarona katakora heta. That was wonderful. Friends, we want to say thank you to the Archangels and the Legions of Angels, to Archangels Michael and Metatron. Archangels, Archangel Michael's lightning blue cloak, Archangels Metatron, Archangel Metatron's gold orange cloak, or orange gold cloak. Took us through this whole transmission. Us here in the third dimension space, we need this protection right now. So I'm going to hope that they remind me every time that we need to do this protection. For all of you and for me, we are doing the work of light. We're invoking the work of light. Remember, when you do this with me, you're not just doing it for yourself. You're doing it for everyone else on the planet. We are bringing in the energy of the dragons and how they can help us. These dragons... Are waiting, have been waiting for us to wake up to them. And so, we will find the answers to things that are confusing on YouTube, not to kill the energy or anything, because I'm not doing that, but I need to be accountable to all of you to say what is the solution. We've had a Rumble channel and we're on odyssey.com for a long time. So those are our options. Okay, and um, I certainly love being on YouTube. I love the op opportunities it presents for us. And it has been the way shower for all this time for anybody who does work here and, and on other platforms. So let's hope that we get good answers where we know that we are being treated with integrity on the channel. Uh, and I know you understand this because if you had an employer who wasn't being honest with you, for example, and you found out and you thought that, if you, for example, was sales rep and you did all these sales and your, your employer was not giving you the, the sales you expected, the sales figures that you expected, then you would be questioning whether you work with that employer, wouldn't you? Whether you carry on with them. So friends, we already have our Rumble channel. It's been in progress, you know, transferring everything onto Rumble. And finally, I got the um, courage to, to sync both channel, the sync it with YouTube. And so that is actually in progress where all the videos are coming up there. So if all else fails, we'll be on Rumble. And I hope that we'll catch you there too, because well, so it is. But at the moment, we are still here on YouTube and we will continue for as long as we can. Thank you so much, and I hope you caught the Rainbow Dragon moments. And so much love to all of you, and thank you for your support. I appreciate all of you. I really do, and everybody else that works on the Great Awakening Generator with me feels the same way. We've got some incredible people on the Great Awakening Generator doing some amazing things, sharing some wonderful things. I mean, did you catch the moments with the monk? That went live on Saturday. And I tell you what, if you ever got to meet Monk Manobi Ramadas, you will know that he's an excellent, excellent person. Yes, he's a quite a young man and he's an excellent person. So there you go, you're getting people with that kind of integrity and caliber. And they operate from the platform of love. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll catch you next time here on Light Language Messenger or on the Great Awakening Generator. Namaste everyone.